So I've known about Daniel Chester French for a long, long time. I wrote the weekly antiques column for the New York Times for many years. And at one point I went up to Chesterwood when they were um, moving French's archive out of the house to Williams College's library, right, to make it much more accessible for scholars. And uh, yes, magic place and uh, magically intact studio. How many American artists have that much of their work preserved in one place where they originally worked? And, and Margaret French is the gold standard, right? We should all have a Margaret French who takes care of our archive like that and makes sure that our legacy, I'm sure your son William is gonna do that for you, right? <laughs> all your footage, every all your papers, everything preserved uh, beautifully and your legacy defended the way Margaret did.